Yeah, so I'm working on trying to get the uh, styling issues that happened with the uh, Angular 11 update fixed in Web UI, and um, hopefully it doesn't seem like that should take up too much more of my time. And then I will um, confirm that it's working and deploy the um, package so we can update it on care to um, to make sure it looks good. Uh, after that, I know I have some stuff. Uh, that Derek reviewed and I'm gonna take a look at that and make those changes that he suggested um, So I can get that pushed in for the date component that I was working on and John I got your uh, message that you sent me uh, I will take a look at that and hopefully if it's not something that can Take too much time. I'll try to knock it out real quick if it looks like it's gonna be a little bit more involved I, I will prioritize that and see if you need me to work on it and that's pretty much it for me. Yep, sure, sure. Let me know. Okay, okay. I have a daily stand-up at the same time every day. Um, it's just basically to kind of let people know what you're working on and if you're stuck on anything or if there's anything that you need um, your project manager to take a look at and whatnot. For the most part, they, you know, they're they're brief and sometimes they can kind of go off topic some or too into topic and then a lot of times we just kind of, you know, if we're going too far into something, we just make it um, another meeting or stick around after stand-up to, to cover what it was that we were talking about to the person that can help us with it rather than take up everybody else's time. But other than that, now I'm just going to kind of get to work a little bit and do some of the stuff that I was talking about. I'm going to have to deploy uh, our library and update our NPM package and all that stuff. Hopefully that shouldn't take too much time because I did kind of find what was causing the issues with the styles in our code base when we updated to Angular 11. I didn't have too many emails today and I didn't have too much stuff that people were asking me about over the weekend and I don't have any other meetings. I had my one-on-one -on -one scheduled for this afternoon but that got moved to Wednesday so right now I'm just got a lot of time to code and work on all the stuff that I'm trying to catch up on that I've been working on because I had a task. Um, couple weeks ago that took more time than I needed it to and there's a lot of stuff that I need to work on now so that's what I'm gonna be doing so I'm gonna finish up my work now and try to make it to my COVID test I have a doctor's appointment on Thursday that requires me getting a COVID test um, so to wrap up what I did for work today, um, I pretty much uh, got some of the stuff that I was working on fixed for the library update that we were doing and the style issues that happened there. I figured out what the problem was that um, didn't have to do with the build but was actually um, had to do with the application that was using the library. I figured that all out. I went and did all the stuff that was pointed out in code review and left a message for the person who reviewed it because I had a question on one of the things that they were asking about there. And then I am going to wrap up the things I've been working on today so I can know what I'm gonna work on tomorrow when I get in. And tomorrow I'm gonna to focus on the, the thing that the tester mentioned this morning in stand-up that he asked me to look at and see how, how much work it would be and if I could get it done or just kinda, you know, uh, make it a bigger task and then I am going to work on getting the library that we used that needed to be updated. It was using ng bootstrap and ng bootstrap has a deprecated component that we use throughout that entire library for the tab set so I have to go in and change all those tab sets to use the nav directive and that's kind of a uh, more tedious work than, than anything else. It doesn't seem like it'll be too complicated, but there's probably 20 different pages that have, you know, a bunch of different tabs on them, and I'm gonna have to restructure a little bit and use a different directive um, rather than the one that was deprecated. So that'll be probably most of my work tomorrow. And yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, it's, it's boring. Uh, I sit at a desk all day. I try to tell people that because there's so many day in the life videos of software developers that try to make it look all glitz and glamor. And the truth is when you're working from home or you're working remotely, 
uh, you don't have this cool campus to go to um, or you know most people don't actually work at places that have cool campuses to go to but you don't have an office to go to so most of the work that you do is just going to be you in front of your computer screen uh, working. I have a very different setup than what I'm used to. I bought a cheap little 27 inch monitor to travel around with because I can't carry my Odyssey G9. That's probably going to go into storage while we travel and um, figure out what we're going to do when we get to my wife's parents house. I'll have this small monitor for the time being. It's good enough. It gets the job done. I will miss my G9 and it's kind of sad that it's just going to sit in storage for a few months. But that's the reality of things. We're going to be driving around in a minivan. I can't carry around that big ass monitor and take it with me wherever I need to go and wherever I'm going to be working from. So I have to uh, be a little bit more reasonable with the stuff that I bring with me. So the G9 didn't make the cut. And, you know, right now I'm just kind of in a, in you know, not the nicest Airbnb. It was just a place for us to stay over the weekend and to work on Monday and Tuesday before we go back to the house because we're gonna be done showing the house now at this point and we're gonna go get offers and accept offers on Tuesday evening. So um, I'm wrapping up Monday now and when I get back, I'll probably do a little bit more work. I don't think I'm gonna get any footage on that because it's pretty much everything you've seen me do. And then I'm just gonna hang out with my wife and kids for the most part. So, and just kind of chill and watch some TV and enjoy, uh, you know, not having to do anything, not having to pack or, you know, clean or get the house ready anymore because that's all done. We're kind of just relaxing and I'll probably end up editing this YouTube video later on and maybe get some footage of me doing that. Um, so yeah.